those are the big three, the big three that we quite often find and that we often talk about. But like the reason we use E. coli as an indicator is because there are lots of different things, even here in New Zealand, that can be in water that we can catch. So for a little bit of fun, we'll talk a little bit some numbers. So bacteria, there are around 538 species of bacteria which are known to make people sick. There's a little bit of a list there for you to have a look at. Some of the ones that you might have heard of, Campylobacter, Salmonella, Shigella, which is also called dysentery, Yersinia, Vibrio cholerae, or cholera as it's otherwise known, Legionella, Pseudomonas syringarosa, and Clostridium botulinium, or botulism as it's otherwise known. They're just some of them. You can imagine how difficult and expensive it would be to test for 538 species of bacteria. That's why we stick with one. Viruses are also a problem in water supplies. They can make us sick as well. They're very difficult to test for, but they can still be there. Some of the ones that you can catch from water that you might have heard of are hepatitis A and E, norovirus, polio, a poliovirus, adenovirus, astrovirus, and calciviruses. Those last three you might not have heard of by name, but they're quite often called diarrhea and sickness bugs.